To be regarded as a trailblazer in our profession by a younger generation of lawyers is very humbling to me because it makes me realize that others are looking to me as a role model. And that is a responsibility that I take very seriously and it makes me strive to do a good job each and every day because I want to set a good example for others as a mentor. My parents are certainly my biggest role models because they taught me, among many things, the importance of a strong work ethic. My parents aren't attorneys, but they taught me that no matter what type of work you do, the most important thing is to take pride in your work and to do the best job possible. My mother used to work at St. Vincent's Hospital in Manhattan, and my father owned his own New York City taxi cab for many years. And watching them work so hard and take so much pride in the work that they did has been a guiding principle for me throughout my professional career and has made me the person that I am today. Being appointed the attorney in charge for the Trenton branch of the U.S. Attorney's Office has certainly been one of the biggest achievements in my career thus far. In the District of New Jersey, the U.S. Attorney's Office has three offices, the main office in Newark and branch offices in Trenton and in Camden. So to be entrusted with the significant responsibility of being the head of one of the, off of the district's three offices was just um, an amazing amount of recognition for the work that I've been doing at the office and continues to be a rewarding experience. I have been blessed with several great mentors throughout my career thus far, and those relationships have certainly opened many doors for me. Um, from the clerkship that I had with Justice Wallace that I was so fortunate to obtain, to the strong relationships that I've maintained with the partners at my former law firm, to the friendships that I've cultivated with other lawyers in the profession. All those relationships have been tremendous in opening doors to opportunities for me that I may not otherwise have um, been aware of or that may otherwise have not been available to me. I would first like to thank the Garden State Bar Association for this great honor. I'd also like to thank my family and friends who have been constant supporters of me throughout my career and my life. Um, I'd like to thank my husband Rob who is not only a great husband and father to our boys but he is my biggest cheerleader throughout everything that I do. And last but certainly not least I'd like to thank my parents who, um, for everything that they've done for me. Um, my parents are immigrants from Haiti and came to this country for the same reason that many immigrants come here in search of a better life for themselves and their families. So I, I know that everything that I achieve in my life and in my career is a direct result of the sacrifices that they made and their hard work to ensure that I had a great life with great opportunities so I can never thank them enough for everything that they've done for me. Takes over me, feel like a man.